but holy moly. And you're just looking at that thing. It just crept along the ground, but maybe that's why it got as old as it did without dying. And I can't imagine it to be, you know, living much longer because of the way it's all broken up and stuff. But this is just, you know, it's a softer wood. You usually don't see these things around where I am in the wild living that big. If uh, it was someone's front yard and a, like a weeping willow, you might see it get that big. But I mean, I say that with no authority, but psh, tell me that's a small willow tree. So I would think it's several hundred years old. It's got to be pushing around 300 years old. And that would make sense. You know, no one would have cut this down for, uh, for logs. No one would have done that with the oak trees around us. It's next to a, a lake. This is uh, in a really narrow, thin band of, of uh, you know, of land. So it's probably not good agriculture land. You know, grazing wouldn't have killed it. So, it, you know, in the 1860s, when this area here was being parceled up, I can see how, you know, this might not be your first choice of what you're going to cut down when there's oak trees and uh, whatever else around you, maples. So... So this thing is just impressive to me. And it sort of sits hidden because it's like a major uh, recreational lake to my left over here and to my right, this is different parcels of private property. And if you just think about like, you know, this is all that same tree. This is that same tree. This is that same tree in front of me. It all leads back to that major you know, large trunk. It's not just a bunch of willow trees. So that makes it, I think, even more impressive. You know, it doesn't tower really high, but it sure is a big old tree. And um, I found it sort of, right? Maybe, no? Well, anyway, either, either way, I think it may have been here first. It's very difficult to capture. It's very difficult to capture it on, on LIDAR or with uh, all the county mapping and stuff, the GIS stuff, the surveys of... Uh, satellite pictures and stuff. You just can't really get a good picture of it because of the way it's laid in here, low to the ground and brush. So uh, I'll have to think about if I want to try to leave it alone or help it out if there's such a thing. Just look at it.